More than 100 Virginia school divisions have announced plans to combat learning loss and chronic absenteeism. Yeah, Governor Youngkin announced millions of dollars will be available to implement tutoring programs and also strengthen the Virginia Literacy Act. Sarah Hammond is in the studio with details. Well, it's part of the state's All in Virginia initiative to distribute $418 million. The All stands for Attendance, Literacy and Learning. And so far, about 115 divisions out of 131 have submitted their plans to the Virginia Department of Education. Learning loss and chronic absenteeism are still areas where Virginia school divisions are struggling. Despite all the hard work and efforts that are happening, our students are not recovering learning loss as quickly as some other state. Two months after Governor Glenn Youngkin made the announcement that divisions across the state would benefit from more than $400 million, Superintendent of Public Instruction Lisa Kuhn says most divisions have submitted their plans for how they want to use that money. Well, I think we're very happy with the progress and we're excited about how intentional our school divisions are being and how thoughtful they are about really digging in where they need to. Each division allotted 70% of funding for tutoring, 20% to advance the Virginia Literacy Act, and 10% to address chronic absenteeism. In the next fiscal year, Virginia Beach is budgeting $7 million towards tutoring and summer camps for at-risk students. They're also budgeting $700,000 to employ 10 attendance ambassadors to provide support for families and schools with high levels of chronic absenteeism. Absenteeism. Norfolk's absenteeism funds will support after hours outreach by school based mental health staff to intervene with students and families. They want to allot $10 million to contract tutors and hire retired teachers to tutor before or after school. And Portsmouth plans to hire attendance officers and parent liaisons to conduct bi monthly attendance workshops. So we encourage everyone who's watching this to sign up and become a tutor and support our schools. For divisions that have struggled with hiring educators in the past, Kuhn says her office is having individual conversations about how the state can offer support to make these plans feasible. Sarah Hammond, 13 News Now, back to you. Sarah, thanks. Virginia Beach, Norfolk, Suffolk, Newport News, Chesapeake, and Portsmouth school divisions have all submitted their plans. Hampton is still in the works, though Kuhn says there is no deadline.